star, but a strong finish. Yeah. Um, yep. <laughs> Concerned with that. I mean, we've talked about slow starts, and it's different every game. Yeah, I, I think I think I think I I expected that we might come out a little flat tonight, coming back from the road trip we came on. So this is one of those ones where you, you give them a little bit of leeway, you know. Um, unfortunately, we're down two nothing, um, so that's a tough hole to get out of against a good defensive team. But um, you know, I thought uh, second and third period we pushed hard. We did some good stuff. There's only one team that scored fewer goals than you guys have in the first period, and that's the San Jose Sharks. Mm -hmm. Is that a stat that, as a coach, gives you a little bit of extra motivation? Yeah, well, for sure. We we know that we know that's an issue. Um, you know, it's something that we talk about and we're trying to address. And um, you know, it's been hit or miss. We've had some good starts, and we've had some you know, but more poor ones than than good ones. So it's definitely on our radar and. Uh, you know, something I know we're capable of getting fixed. In the third period, you guys scored the goal, and then Mason had the penalty. Yeah, you guys kind of really zapped. Yeah, poor, poor penalty, poor timing. You know, no, no sugarcoating that. You know, I'd like to, I'd like to say it was a bad call, but it was, it was a penalty, and you know, you can't do that at that point. We've, we've battled back into the game, and you know, he's, a, he's a smarter, better player than that. For um, you, he didn't play the rest of the game. Is that a message just to him that that? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Robertson, I think 24, 25 yeah. minutes of ice time. He was the guy you talked about this morning. Yeah, he was gone. Could that actually help his help him? Yeah, I, I I hope it'll help. You know, we're trying to get him going. Obviously, um, you know, it's we've had a tough time scoring here the last few games. He's not alone in that boat. But uh, you know, we wanted to load him up tonight if if uh, we could and. And we did that with both him and Rupe. Rupe Hintz and Wyatt Johnson had a shift there on the penalty kill. Where mm -hmm. They were electric going the other way. Is that a pairing that you yeah. might want to explore? Uh, you know what? They were great. I, I thought Johnny was was outstanding. I mean, that's uh, you know we got a real flash for you know for him. He he's been uh, stuck a little bit too in the mud lately. So uh, it was nice to see him at the level that he's capable of playing tonight for a long stretch. He took the game over. Um, yeah, I don't know if we'll use those two guys together. I think it was one of those situations where we're, we're pushing hard to score a goal there. We're not thinking as much about the kill. Um, but, uh, you know, they could have had two on that that uh, kill. I don't know if this is an outside thing for, for that we look at, but... The final minute, can that carry over at all? The way that you guys kind of were, were buzzing. It? Well, I, I would hope, I would hope the the final forty minutes would carry over. You know, we pushed hard and 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 competed hard and uh, did a lot of good stuff. So you know that fight um, that we showed down the stretch. We, you know, we have to carry that over onto the next road trip. And what did you make of Joel Hanley's play, sir? I thought Hanner did. You know, he, he's 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 such a good pro. You know, it's such a tough situation to be put into and do what he does. And, you know, he, every time you put him in, he, he gets the job done. Um, you know, just great admiration for him.